Welcome everybody. In today's podcast, I'm just going to continue uh, some thoughts, ideas around colour and how colour adds to our lives without us even realising it. Uh, I know there's a lot of talk around colour for interior design and spaces we occupy, um, but as you know from my other podcast, the colour that truly resonates with us is the colour we find in nature. And so the colour I just want to briefly talk about in this podcast, I saw this evening as the sun set. There are a huge range of reds and ochres and yellows that appear as the sun dips behind the horizon uh, signalling the end of a day. But one colour that stuck for me, and it wasn't the dominant colour of sunset, was that beautiful colour called magenta. And as with the other colours I'm talking about on the podcast, I've begun to use a lot of magenta in my Autumn Wonderland series and I not, I'm not sure how I'm going to let it go when I do the Winter Wonderland paintings. I'm sure it will appear somewhere. So what does magenta mean? I think across a lot of cultures, magenta is seen as the colour of universal harmony and emotional balance. It contains the passion, power and energy of red, restrained by the introspection and quiet energy of violet. It promotes compassion, kindness and cooperation. And the colour magenta is often seen also as a colour of cheerfulness, happiness, contentment and appreciation. So, as I said in my last podcast, in the next day or night, look around you, see if you can find magenta in your world because it will give you something without you even realising it. Thanks for listening.